Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm in Czech Republic in order to race for the second RC Rally of the Moravia Cup Championship. Today's rally is going to be extremely fun and interesting because it's divided in two parts. The first one is going to be on tarmac and the second one is going to be off-road. So, four stages on tarmac and the other four off-road. The first part of the rally is going to be held here. I just tested the, the car, here is extremely grippy and on this side we have uh, less, uh, less grip. Talking about this setup, I did like uh, an average setup because uh, the car has to go on tarmac and uh, off-road. So at least in the morning I think it's going to be a bit of uh, suffering because uh, I have the differential oil 5000-3000 and on uh, such grippy surface is not the best uh, option. Looking at the course, it feels like it's going to be a quite fast uh, rally. I don't see so much uh, tight uh, corners. And now let me show you where we are going to race this uh, afternoon. So this is the off-road part of uh, today's rally. We are going to have uh, grass, and uh, gravel. Okay, let's go back on my desk and I'm going to show you today's uh, setup, how it looks and uh, what I did in order to prepare my X-Ray XB4 for today's rally. Okay, talking about this setup, I'm going to start the rally with Pirelli tires. They are extremely grippy and I've changed the springs to harder one in the morning. Here we have the softer one. And uh, in the afternoon, I'm going to change the springs and the tires. I will use the soft springs and uh, pin uh, tires. It's an average setup. I'm suffering in the corners because the differential oil in the front is not thick uh, enough. Probably during this stage, you will notice how I will lose uh, time to time uh, speed on tight corners when the weight of the model is going to go on the uh, right tire or left tire depending by the corner. I will do a bit of uh, shake down as the others and maybe see you on the first stage or if I will see something interesting I will share it with you. So the rally is starting. Here we have uh, Tomasz, a very fast driver from Czech Republic. You saw him a few times on my YouTube channel. Let's enjoy his uh, stage. Okay, let's start this rally. 30 seconds to go.
I did a few mistakes, unluckily. Let's see my time. 12th place, 14 seconds from the first place. I just did the first stage, uh, 14 seconds from the first place. I did two mistakes, I had almost a rollover and then uh, accidentally I cut a corner and I had to came back. I think that uh, without these mistakes I will be able to be, let's say, nine seconds from the first place. But um, honestly, I'm not so happy about this setup because, uh, as you notice, when there is uh, a lot of uh, grip, the car is like uh, sitting on a side. And uh, I cannot change uh, this uh, problem because I don't have the harder springs. The one that I, I have two pair of springs right now, super soft and uh, let's say medium soft, but the medium soft um, are not uh, hard enough. So, uh, right now I will try to drive in the best possible way, in a clean uh, way, and I will try to survive uh, till the second part of this rally, which is going to be uh, off-road. Okay, let's go and let's start the second stage. I will try to improve my time. Let's see, I'm secure to see my time. I think that I did a good job. No, I can't believe it. Again, 12th time. 8 seconds. 8 seconds from the first place. Mm, it was better, but uh, not good enough. I just did the first two stages. I'm really enjoying this uh, event and talking about this setup. I need to put harder springs, the, which uh, I don't have, I will need to, to buy them. But in general, I'm learning a lot. It's the first time for me driving this uh, X-Ray in uh, such uh, conditions. So today's rally is going to help me through the rest of the season. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to change uh, the battery for the next uh, two stages. And then... Uh, I'm going to switch the tires, the front one to the rear and the rear one to the front, in order to have a more, let's say, homogeneous uh, wearing, uh, worn out. Talking about the performances, uh, I'm in general around uh, 10 seconds from the first place uh, each uh, stage. And yeah, it's not, let's say, a great uh, result, but uh, this first half of this RC rally season, for me, is going about uh, learning how to drive this uh, X-Ray XB4 and uh, about how to set it up in the proper way for each condition. I'm so curious about the second part of the rally, the one that's going to be off-road. Uh, two weeks ago I had a second place in an off-road rally in, uh, back in Poland, so let's see how I will compare myself to this uh, top uh, RCR driver here in Czech Republic. Good luck, Danny. Thanks. Okay, let's start the last stage here on uh, Tarmark. I will try to do a good time, but uh, today's setup is not, uh, let's say, good enough for this kind of surface. But it's all experience for the rest of the season.
The first half of this rally is over. Now we are going to switch uh, to off-road and what else can I say? I was slow. The third, fourth uh, stage I was something like from 20 to 30 seconds uh, far away from the first place. But uh, from the other side I saw some extremely fast uh, RC rally driver. And I was able, uh, from my eyes, to learn uh, new things. After three rallies uh, of this beginning of 2024 season, um, I'm quite sure that I have a good uh, off-road setup, but I still uh, need to learn and improve a uh, setup for uh, high grip uh, surfaces. I already prepared my x rays before uh, for the next part of this uh, rally, which is going to be off-road. I've changed the springs, I've increased the ground clearance, and uh, I've put a slimmer sway bar in the, in the rear. And um, in general, two weeks ago, I was quite fast off-road in a RC rally in Poland. I was able to do a second place. Here, for sure, I will not be able to, to win because the level, I think, it's uh, higher. But uh, at least I will try to have better times comparing them in, in, uh, to the ones they, that I had uh, in the morning. In the morning I was like 20-30 seconds away from the first place here I want to reduce the, this gap. Okay, so wish me good luck and see you on the second part of this rally. Okay, let's start the second stage of this uh, part of the rally, it's going to be off-road. I did the first stage, I did a few mistakes but uh, I'm quite happy about my performance. I will try to drive in a quite clean, uh, clean way. Ah.
tutaj cisną. Oh. 25. Czas RZ. RZ 15 miejsce. Próbieżne pożadzi 15 miejsce. 15 place. 25 seconds from the first place. So guys, I just did the first two stages uh, of road. In general, I'm around from 15 to 20 seconds away from the first uh, place. The guy that is leading this rally is driving in an amazing uh, way. But uh, anyways, I'm always trying to improve and I modified something right now in the setup. Something that I already was using back in the first rally of this season in the second one. And then I decided to change it in order to, to test it, but uh, it's not a good uh, idea. So what I did right now, I increase uh, again the toe-in here on the rear suspensions. 0 0.5. It's going to help me to have a much, uh, much uh, stable rear while giving uh, power exiting uh, a corner because the rear wheels are, let's say, not anymore straight, but uh, they, are, they have this uh, direction. They are going inwards toward the chassis. Let's see in the next stage if this uh, modification is going to help me to drive in a better way, and uh, we'll see which time I'm going to, to get. Okay, let's start the third uh, stage here of road. I made some changes uh, in the rear, as I said before. Let's see. Oh, now it's much better. I can control the rear in a much better way. A bit of unlucky moment in this uh, stage, but let's see the time. Fifteen place, 31 seconds from the first place. So the rally is over. Behind me they are getting ready for the podium. I ended up this rally around 15, 17 place. It's not a good result, but uh, I had a lot of fun. I will need to train uh, more and maybe I will start to use again the RC simulator that I was using during the, the winter. By the way, guys, thank you for staying with me. Remember to leave a like and subscribe in order to support my channel. And see you next week for a new video.
Tchau.